Welcome back, everyone. Kremlin Archer here. Time for some more March of the Living. So we're uh, we're doing pretty well. We've got, I think, a three-party purse, three-party trip going on now. Yeah, three of us. We got um, Barry, Sarah, and Greg here. Move everybody to the middle. Um, Barry's getting a little tired. Actually, you know what I'm going to do is I'm actually going to have. I'm going to go have both of these. We'll have Sarah stay awake since she's doing fine, and then we're just going to. Um, rest here until things are a little bit a little bit better <clears throat> and that's probably good enough all right now we're all awake so Sarah what do you have I don't remember what Sarah has she has a pistol and nothing else and we don't have yeah, we don't have an extra melee weapon to give her so she's just gonna have to stay with her pistol all right so let's hit so we we're going across the bottom was the plan I think we we're going to go across the bottom here and then swing up past this city on the way. On the way out. So let's see, where are we? We're here. So let's go. I think the best jump is probably here. We got the, the arm swing in unison. It's a good look. All right. The slow, loud reports of single rounds being fired snaps you to attention. Concerned that you might end up in someone's field of fire, you move cautiously toward the source. Soon enough, you spot an out-of-place bush, complete with scoped rifle sticking out. Weapons prepared, you call out a greeting. Hi! The bush calls back in a friendly tone, ushering you over. Turns out that the bush is in fact a small a man in a, in a ghillie suit, and that he has been hunting rotters basically for sport. The number of corpses laying on the laying in the open field in front of you is quite impressive. Um, if we had a loaded rifle, we could spark up a shooting competition, but we don't, so we just have to walk away. Quietly walk away from the scene, bidding the man farewell. Farewell. Feel as if you, as if you have better things to do, better places to be. Okay. Alright, okay, we're gonna go here. It's getting tired again. Should probably do another round of resting. Um, we'll wait till we're in the next location. The road is blocked by a group of infected, too big to fight, so you decide to take a detour of the main road. After fighting your way through the road, through the trail of tree roots and overgrown flora, you, you come across an abandoned house, long since retaken by nature, and you estimate back at least 60 years. Um, we've done this one before. We'll enter the shelter. Alright, um... Oh, this is different. Recouping from the ill effects of being inside a mass grave, you might make your way back to the road. As you reach it, however, you hear a ra uh, racking of a pistol slide being cocked behind you. Now that you've seen my little lair, I'm afraid I can't let you leave, a calm, suave voice states behind you. A bad feeling about this. All right. You duck the earth shuts and prepare to fight. All right. Pause. Thank you. Um, there, please. You come this way. I'm actually going to have um, him get right up in his business. You, I'm going to switch back to your revolver. And you can take a shot, too. See how this goes. Oh, there we go. Not too bad. Bandage, which Barry will just get and use. <clears throat> Sorry I didn't read that last one. I thought it was an event that we'd done already, but it was not. All right, we need to rest. Um, Sarah will stay awake. F nope, Greg is going to stay awake for right now. Yeah, I know you're hungry, Greg. It'll be all right. All right, let's wake up. Let's eat. Everybody eats. We're actually going to rest again. Sarah will stay awake this time and let... Greg, re recuperate a little bit here. And that's probably good enough. Oh, yeah. All right, we're going to go here. I suppose I should just hit this fast forward button. No reason to wait on all this. As you walk over the crest of a hill, a pack of rotters comes into view, shuffling along the road. Find a way around them. No time to waste. Take them down. Let's take them down. 
Um, so what do we got? Oh, it's a group of actual regular rotters. All right, you're gonna wait, lady, because you don't have a melee weapon. These two guys are gonna come forward. You need to equip your machete. All right, so you take that guy. You take that guy. All right, Greg, come here. You come here. <coughs> Excuse me. Greg hits that guy. You get this guy. Greg comes this way. All right. Um. Yeah. You get that guy. Greg, I need you to move away, and now you can come back. I keep letting Barry get hit because I'm focused on Greg. Hey, two food rations, nice. Uh -huh, let's see. What do we need to do? I guess we keep moving. That's probably the better. Let's see, where are we at? This, so we need to go this way. So we need to go to this one, probably. Alright, we're gonna absolutely. We should. I was gonna say we're gonna need to stop and. Rest soon. You know what? I'm gonna let her um, take some shots here. Let me shoot this way. Greg, come this way. Lady, shoot the one that's actually has a better chance of getting of actually getting hit here. Um, Greg. You wanna you wanna actually take a swing there, buddy? Alright, uh Greg, take this. You actually are gonna go into wait mode and come over here. I would just There we go. Come on, hit him. There you go. Shotgun gels, thank you. Alright, we gotta sleep. Rest. Sarah stays awake. Whoops. Alright. Oh, oh, come on. Fall back. Nope, you fall back too. Ain't everybody falling back here. We got too many of these guys. Um. And then sh let's get your revolver here. Uh, shotgun. You shoot this way, please. You just keep moving. Right. Fall back. It's a uh, machete. It's Barry has his axe now. All right, there we go. Greg, I need you to move. There we go. All right, cool. Well, that was kind of exciting, but it seemed to work out okay. I will rest a little bit more. I'm gonna go back to normal speed here so that we don't have quite such craziness. Barry, I'll stay awake. Yes, don't worry. He'll get something to eat soon. All right, wake up. Eat, everyone eats, travel. You stumble across a few cans of food lying suspiciously in the center of the road. You look around for a second, but no one seems to be around. <clears throat> um, yeah, sure, let's pick up the food. Who do you want to send in? Let's send Barry... Sarah in. Watch the center road picks up the cans of food. Two men jump out of the tree line and open fire. The bullets hissing, snapping as they fly past. She lost two HP. Alright, All right, Barry. You shoot. If you if I give you your revolver, what are your odds of hitting this guy? Hang on, guys. Sorry about that. 
Alright, so if you have this gun, about 90% chance, really? Oh no, 75% chance from there. That's fine. There we go. You have anything useful? Oh, yes, you do. Hello. Um, put it mostly on her, it looks like, probably. There we go. Is anybody a rifle expert, by the way? Intermediate? Intermediate? Intermediate. Alright, everybody's... Everybody's intermediate with a rifle. That's fine. Reload all these, too. Alright, map. Where are we here? Worried about us. Concerned about leaving the the uh, leaving this page of the map as well. <laughs> Just not not super psyched about it. Getting tired. Hello, stranger. Got some quality goods for sale if you're interested. Five seconds forward. What do you say? Sure, we'll trade with him. I knew coming up I'd do being good. Here, have a look. He opens a large uh, duffel bag filled with wares and drops in front of you with the hits the ground with a thud. All right, so what do you got? No, I was hoping for a melee weapon. Apparently, no, we don't have any. So let's see, what can we get rid of? I think we have two fishing rods now, don't we? Yes, we do. So we can get rid of one of the fishing rods, um, which will let us buy the food. Semi-automatic pistol, we've got that. Rusty shotgun, we got one of those. Teddy bear, duct tape. Kind of want to buy the duct tape. Sell one of these wedding rings, and we'll replace it with duct tape. Doesn't have anything particularly useful, though, does he? Alright. We can get rid of this old revolver. And get us three credits. Hmm. Might not be worth it though. Yeah, I think we're probably fine. I got the food, which is what I was really concerned about. Alright, close. We rest here. I like that he's just gonna stand there and have a stare off. <laughs> just stare at each other. Alright, come on, fatigue, get down there. Alright, good enough. Map. Alright, so we're trying to go to this this city here, so we're gonna go here. Alright, now Greg's getting tired. In the middle of the road sits a lone vehicle, a family sedan with more than enough room to hold you and everything you own. Its doors have been left open, as if the owners were forced to depart suddenly. You carefully examine the interior back to front, find no evidence of a struggle, nor telltale signs of infection present in the upholstery. Simply abandoned, just like that. The keys are still in the ignition. Alright, try to start the car. Turn the key and the engine does start briefly before sputtering and dying. Confused, you pop the hood in, of the car and take a look. Everything looks fine as far as you can tell. Fuel gauge wasn't reading empty either, so that can't be it. So, we need mechanic. Ugh, this mechanic trait keeps getting us. Walk away, alright. So sad. Wait, can we rest here? No. Not I mean, we can, and we are, but not with any advantage. Thought maybe we could sleep in the car. Alright, good enough. Eat, eat, map, city. Hope we can find a. I'd like to try and find a, a safe place in the city because it'd be nice to get everybody at zero. Um, so I think I may actually try to do that first so that we can get her. Please find a place. There we go. Alright, because I'd like to have everybody at zero so we can just start again. There we go. Eat. We'll all eat something. 
Nice, nice zero, zero level here. Let's start with the grocery store. We'll do, we're gonna have to do 60 minute searches in all of these. Which means a lot of zombie fighting probably. Oh, hey, look at that, four food rations. Uh, police station, 60% chance, or 51% chance actually. Oh, there we go. All right, what do we got? One, two, three, we got uh, the whole smorgasbord. We got two rotters, two grabbers, two biters. All right, I need you to back up and then aim for the head. I need you. All right, I'm gonna have him back up. You can come this way as well. All right. Good shot. Oh, that was kind of a waste. Alright. Shotgun shells, pistol bullets, although we basically broke even on that. We got more shotgun shells than we had before. Um, I think I am going to have her switch to this old, the old rifle. Because we got lots of rifle bullets and we haven't used any of them yet. Alright, scavenge hospitals next. And zombies! Yep, there we go. Alright. Let's move her up a little bit. All right, you, I'm gonna have actually have this guy go to the, the full spread. She is going to shoot. It's gonna aim for the head on this guy. No. That guy. You are gonna aim for the upper body on, I don't know, somebody in there. You, I'm gonna switch. I'm gonna save some bullets here. I'm gonna switch um, Barry back to his axe. All right, move, move, Barry, move. I'm not. I don't have Barry selected. That's what the problem is. Barry, move. All right. All right manage. You're gonna be a machete. You're aiming for this guy's head. There we go. go. Alright, you are now waiting because no more bullet. No more bullet wasting. Come on. Should probably just move Greg in there. There we go. Whew, that was a lot of work for some antibiotics. Alright, Barry. You go ahead and use them because you're not in, in very good shape. Alright, uh, apartments next. 60 minute search. Cue the zombies. Oh, we got him. A wallet, huh? I have a wallet. Got a lot of food in that one. Alright, so we gotta do this again. Um, drugstore. I'm only gonna do a 40 minute search on the drugstore. I just wanna, I kinda wanna not die again. <laughs> oh, too late. Should've done the full one. Alright. She still has three bullets. Alright. You shoot at that one. Barry switch to the shotgun. Barry's gonna do this shot on right there. You switch to your revolver. I don't really care who you shoot at, but you need to reload. Reload, reload. Um Okay, so the, the big guys are down. down. Oh, come on. What's going on here? Um, manage group. 
equip your axe, you equip your machete. Barry, come over here. Greg, attack this guy. You wait. Oh, little little craziness happened in there. All right, you're going to attack that guy right there. Greg, move. Barry, move. Wish I had a melee weapon for her. Alright, get that guy. You get that guy, and you move over here. There we go. Come on, guys. Oh, oh, Barry, move. Oh, just stop missing. Big weenie. There you go. More food rations. That's everything, right? Yeah, that's everything. Alright, that was a little intense. I'm going to stop here for today, and I'll see you guys next time.